If you want to create a custom greetings card in Word, I've linked in the description a custom template that I have created. It is a quarter fold card and how it works is there is a text box in each quarter containing text or text and images. These two are the front and back and these top two are the insides. These are upside down because when you print and fold them it will then appear right side up. And then you can customize this however you like. This one's obviously a happy birthday card. Um, Father's Day is coming up. So if you wanted to make a Father's Day card, do that. And then you can change the font if you don't think it fits and the color. And then you can also increase the font size to fit better on the page. And then make these images something related to dads. For example, a tie or a tool, whatever is personal to you. So copy and paste that from Google. And then you want to make sure it's a PNG so that um, the background of the image um, blends in with the card. So it's all white. Move it down, maybe right there. And then you want to repeat that with all four corners. Then the back side of the card, um, this is totally optional. Just depends on how big your ego is. Here, you can add a, another image or leave this page blank. It's up to you. I usually like to add some image. Again, make sure that it's a PNG. And then we don't really need these other images in this case. And then if you have trouble clicking on things, you can always go to picture format selection pane. And then I want to select this text box and then move it so it's in the center, around the center of the page. And then last page is the message. So you can, this is the most personal page, so you want to make it connection with your dad. So put whatever, maybe an inside joke or something. I'm going to put something very generic. And then make the font consistent, increase the font size, and if you want this to be, there's too much spacing in between, you can always, there's 2.5, you can make this, you can mess around with these like that, or even more advanced, um, go into these options. And then this border, um, is in format shape and line. You can change the color of the border. Um, I think I'm going to keep it this color. And then change the transparency, change the width, change the style, compound type, dash, whatever you want to do. And then this is quick and easy and free. It takes like 15 minutes and it's a homemade personal card that's much better than a mediocre Hallmark card.